day 691 being Christopher Cruz. Um, I think it's like 7.30 or something like that. But I went to Starbucks and I was there for a few hours and um, I was reading Romans, which Romans is intense. Um, I only read like this page, this page, these pages, and then this. But look at that, that is so intense. And it was talking about um, what happened when Jesus died for us and law and then grace and like all these different things. I'm taking all these notes and then I got I get to this one sentence where I don't understand it fully. Um, for those who depend on the law are heirs. Faith means nothing and the promise is worthless because the law brings wrath. I was like, what the heck does that mean? And then I realized, oh, I have the Bible app. And I went to the Bible app and I clicked on the easy read version. And I read it and it like made total sense. It was like, oh, that makes sense. And it was just like, just because you follow the law doesn't mean that, that you're going to inherit what God has for you. Um, because if that was the case, all you would have to do is follow the law and you wouldn't have to have faith. So faith is such a, a huge part of salvation. And uh, did I just say salvation? <laughs> a huge part of salvation and I was like wow that's crazy so I just ordered uh an easy read version of the bible that I could read along with this because like I like the NIV version um but the easy read version is just like in layman's terms like super easy to understand and I feel like that might be one of the best ways to to read the bible is have like your actual version like the NIV version but then have the easy read version um because it's just less processing. It's less work that my mind has to do to actually understand it. And um, yeah, it's just like, I, I get the message more clearly. This takes a lot of like in-depth, like processing. Okay, if that means that, then this means that. And then I read the easy read version. I'm like, what? That's so easy. <laughs> Probably why that's why they call it the easy read version. So, um, so yeah, that was good. I got my food prepped for tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be running the, the team in the morning for setup for the church. Um, so that'll be good. We're having breakfast for everyone, which will be awesome. Um, and I got my lunch prepped for tomorrow. So, yeah. I'm feeling good. I'm going to chill and watch some kind of movie or documentary about God, of course, and all of this stuff. Um, yeah. But today, today was a really good day. So, a chill day, a chill day, which I need those.